the last time you touched the earth with an actual part of your body? If you answered honestly, it was probably much too long ago. Touching your bare skin to the earth is a process known as earthing, and it has undeniable physiological effects. But because we're scientists, we're going to understand why. Oxygen is an element that follows the octet rule. What that means is oxygen wants to have eight electrons in its valence shell. That's just the outermost ring of electrons orbiting the nucleus. Naturally, oxygen only has six electrons in its valence shell, so it needs to get two more electrons from free-floating electrons or electron-lending atoms such as hydrogen in order to be satisfied. However, about 2% of the time, oxygen only bonds with one electron and it doesn't follow the octet rule. This creates what we call a free radical. Free radicals are desperate to bond and will bond with anything, anything at all. They may bond with DNA, the proteins in your red blood cells, or even the fats in the cell membrane. That can wreak havoc in your body, especially in the case where it bonds with DNA, it can cause mutations, which can cause cancer. It can do a lot of damage to any kind of cell and to your body overall. And the free radical theory of aging is a scientific theory that says free radicals are mostly responsible for how we age. Throughout this, we've been pretending like one oxygen and one hydrogen atom are the only kind of free radical, but that's not true at all. Carbon and nitrogen also follow the octet rule and need four or three electrons added to their valence shell, respectively. Otherwise, they are free radicals. Antioxidants counteract free radicals, and that's why people who will eat a lot more blueberries have a higher chance of living longer. But if you absorb too many antioxidants, it can get rid of all the free radicals, and that's not good either. Your body needs free radicals to survive. So the thing killing you is the thing keeping you alive, and therefore you can't live forever. That's fun. Any hopes you had of living forever, down the drain. It's really easy to pick up free electrons by walking on the ground barefooted. This practice has been coined the term earthing, or grounding. Electrons are super awesome because they counteract free radicals and make you live longer. Go electrons! Electrons are actually called antioxidants because they undo the process of oxidization, which is the process that creates free radicals. Electrons and some electron lending atoms, such as hydrogen, can counteract free radicals by joining in and making it follow the octet rule, thusly making it a normal, non-dangerous molecule. By grounding and eating antioxidants, we get free electrons in our system, which counteract the free radicals, making them into normal, non-dangerous molecules. So, how can you ground? To ground, walk barefooted on sand, grass, bare soil, and ceramic tile. You can also walk barefooted on concrete or brick as long as it's not sealed. But really, walking along the beach and in your backyard are the two best places to get grounded. The same reason we earth is why we eat fruit identified as antioxidants and why we have salt lamps in our home. They counteract free radicals, making us live longer. Anyways, thank you for this episode of Proton Science. Please subscribe and leave a like if you found this helpful or you enjoyed it. Have a good rest of your day.